ho, ho. Hello everyone and welcome to the North Pole. You know, the elves and I have been busy prepping for the holidays, feeding the reindeer, tuning up the sleigh, and working up some extra space for lots of cookies and milk. And of course, I've been busy with my favorite part of the holiday season, reading the letters from children all over the world who share their holiday wishes. You know, recently, I received a very special letter from an Alaskan boy I used to know who's all grown up and he asked for a very special gift this year. Do you hear that? I think he might be here. <laughs> Merry Christmas, Trevor. It's so good to see you. Santa, I can't believe it's you. It's a dream come true. Oh, I'm so happy you're here. Have a seat. Thank you. You know, Trevor, I really hope you enjoy dashing through the snow on your way here. It can be really difficult to find if you don't have nine flying reindeer. <laughs> you know, all the work you and the team at the Alaskan Children's Trust are doing to help prevent child abuse and neglect really warms my heart. It even makes Rudolph's nose glow even brighter. So what can we help you with? First, I want to thank all of our partners, donors and advocates, and the entire team at the Children's Trust for all their support in making spirits bright this year. We could not make this year bright without all of you. As you know, Santa, Alaska's Children's Trust mission is to prevent child abuse and neglect. We achieved this mission by helping to ensure children and families have the knowledge, skills, supports, and resources they need to thrive. But Santa, there is unfortunately some bah humbug news I must share. Alaska's children are suffering and families are hurting. Alaska has one of the highest rates per capita of child abuse and neglect in our nation. Many families in Alaska struggle with poverty and the lack of access to mental health or substance misuse treatment. And so many of our children are struggling in school, just to name a few. The other day I heard from Kim who is eight years old about how her family is struggling to find ways to make ends meet. Her mom and dad are stressed out about paying their rent and even buying food, and some of that stress is passing down to her and her little sister. Not to mention, if one of the kids gets sick, then Kim's parents would have to take time off and pay for medical bills because they have no insurance. It just hurts my heart mm. so much to hear these stories like Kim's. You know, hearing about how our children and families are struggling really takes the jingles right out of my bells. I know that ACT is doing big work to protect kids like Kim and give parent support like after school, parenting classes, and access to trauma-informed providers that help out. But how can Alaskans help today? Why don't you take a seat on my lap and tell everyone what would, you would like for the holidays? Okay, Santa. I'm glad you asked Santa because like many children out there, ACT has a special holiday wish list. What we'd like most of all is to encourage all Alaskans to deck the halls with peace, joy, and love. There are so many ways that you, Mrs. Claus, and of course the owls, and all the Alaskans of all ages from one to 92 can support Alaska's children and families. Three of the little things on our list this year that can make the biggest difference are Help us believe in the magic of Christmas by becoming an advocate. Join ACT and help us encourage lawmakers to remember to keep children, youth, and families at the forefront of policy decisions by signing up for our advocacy alerts. Bring joy to the world by participating in a free trauma-informed training or a history and hope training to build up the resilience and hope in yourself and everyone around you. And finally, become Santa's little helper by continuing to support the efforts of the various programs focused on helping children and families thrive. There are so many ways people can help children and families, and all it will take is a little goodwill towards each other. Learn more about our wish list by visiting our website. Wow, Trevor, that's amazing. I know that with organizations like ACT working together, Alaska's children and youth are going to have a bright future. Thank you, Trevor, and you have yourself a merry little Christmas. Thank you, Santa, and thank you, everyone. Together, together we, we can prevent child abuse and neglect. 
Happy holidays to all, and to all a good night.